Welcome back, everybody. My next guest is the Emmy Award winning creator of Transparent and I Love Dick. Please welcome Jill Soloway. Come on, not Jill Soloway. Unbutton, as I said. That's how it unbutton, works, right? Unbutton, and unbutton, unbutton, unbutton everyone, as you right? Said. I do them both. As I do them said. both. It depends on how I'm feeling about my stomach. Yeah. Now, uh, <laughs> uh, your show, Transparent, this is its fifth season. And yes. You, 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 for the fifth season, you did a, a feature length musical yes. for it. Yes. What was it that, for, for sort of this final season, that you wanted to do it as a musical yeah. that sort of changed the style so much? We call it the Music Hail Finale. Okay. Or the Musicali finale. Gotcha. One or the other. I'm on board. Um, and yeah, we kind of wanted to just reset the map, redraw the lines, bring the light back as a show. We had been through a lot, and mm -hmm. we just kind of wanted to go out on our own terms. Mm -hmm. And my sister Faith. Sure, who I know from the old Second City yeah, days. We worked together for a little while back yeah, then when she was a musical director at Second yeah, City. Yeah, she's an amazing musician. Fantastic person. Songwriter, and she yep. wrote a bunch of songs. And we went to Amazon and said, can we make a musical? And they said, okay. <laughs> well, that's nice. Yeah. That's nice. Now, I, kn I know that you were uh, uh, one of the first people in the original meetings for Time's Up. Yes. Okay. This is true. And, and at the same time that you were in those meetings, you were dealing with the allegations of sexual harassment and abuse on your own set. Right, it was like a, it was, there was, I think, one day where in the morning I was at a Time's Up meeting and I was, you know, we had like a wish list. What do we want to do? And I think I was like posting on a wish list on a bulletin board, unlock all NDAs. Non-disclosure agreements yes. for people out there who might not know. It's like, one of the things. The right? contracts like, that say, oh, okay, okay, here's your here's money, your money for what talk. happened to you, but don't tell anybody. And I was asking, like, what would happen if we just told everybody, you know what, you can just talk. And then that same afternoon was when I found out that we had allegations on our show as well. Wow. Yeah, so big what, day. What, 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 what was that, uh, that like, sort of the tension between those two moments? Yeah, I feel in many ways that, um, that, that I just felt like it was my destiny to be there in some ways, that, mm -hmm. that I had to be able to do both. I, ha I had to be able to stand up for Time's Up and the feminist movement and toppling the patriarchy, even if it meant being, yeah. It, I think even being what even a... being crushed under the toppling sure, sure. I was laying you know mm -hmm. underneath the, the toppling of our own show and had to yeah find my way out and find a way to do so with dignity so this fifth season this musical is the de toppling yes the de toppling it's the reconstructing yes. in a new way rising from the ashes singing dancing leading with our heart with light you know just making it fun well you we've got um we, we've got a, a clip right here Great. um uh, let's hear some of the music you spoke about what's happening in this clip so this i think is ari's a bar to mitzvah okay ari comes out as non-binary this season oh so it's a bot and a bar it's a bar to mitzvah it's a bar to mitzvah okay <laughs> <laughs> all at once sure okay and yeah this i think that's what we're gonna look at jim let's do it Run from your father's house There's a land that I will show you I will honor all who honor you Curse all who curse you And all of the families of the earth Shall bless themselves by you And when you get home You won't be alone I promise to not look away Actually, get said in a bar mitzvah or a bat mitzvah. Well, so what Faith did is Faith wrote an English language song based on the same thing that would be written in Hebrew. It's actually like mm -hmm. a Torah portion, which is "Go from your father's house and discover a new land." So Faith kind of reinterpreted it. Um, during making Transparent, you you uh, had your own discovery while yes. making of it, and and you've come out as non-binary. Yes. And I, I want to ask you a question. I mean this just purely curiously and out of respect. Yes. A lot of people focus on the pronouns associated right. with it, and I know. Uh, I understand you prefer they or them rather than he or she. Is that yeah, correct? I do say that she is fine and they is like frosting. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I, what about? It just excites me when people say they because they get it. Why? Well, I, I mean, I'm happy to say they. Whatever people want to be referred to as, yeah. I want to treat them with dignity and respect, and that's no skin off my rosy nose. <laughs> and so. 
I had... There, but there is something about they that's a little bit confusing because yes. of the plural nature of it. Yes. Ha, is there? Have you thought about, or any people you've spoken to about this? Think about like a different word. I had heard like they or them yeah. or something well, like that. Yeah. Well, they actually is used in the English language for the singular a lot. Like if you said, if somebody said, "Steve, your assistant is waiting outside," you would say, "Tell them I'll be there in a few minutes." Or, or maybe somebody whose gender you didn't know. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go pick somebody up at the airport. Oh, what time are they landing? So it's okay. not that I'm two people. It's just that you don't know my gender. Gotcha. Thank you. Gotcha. I understand. No, I get it. Yeah. But I, no, I grew up in the South. I grew up in the South. What about y'all? Yeah, that's fine too. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> well, thank you so much for being oh, here. So nice to so see much. you again. Like the transparent musical finale is streaming on Amazon right now. Jill Soloway, everybody. We'll be right back with comedian Leah Bonemont.